All right, folks, I know it's the first day of the day, you know, I mean, of the week, <laughs> it's Monday, and everything is just red. On When you look at AMC stock, you look at the overall market, you look at some of, the, I mean, your accounts, um, it's very likely that you are in the red. And looking at, you know, this, this, this whole thing around Ukraine and Russia happening, it's hard to be optimistic. So I'm going to share with you some things that... I believe it's going to cheer you up, you know, and lift your hopes up when it comes to, you know, when AMC is heading towards and uh, hopefully you will see exactly what I see and maybe you will have a different view on, you know, the short term here because the goal here is not to get emotional because at the second you start getting emotional, you will be tempted to do stupid things with your money it's including your investments into into a stock like amc so what is happening at the time i'm recording this video amc is down almost seven percent yeah we are flirting again with those 15 dollars a share and uh when you look at the vix you know the vix is really what we call the fear index it's really the reason it's, it's kind of a a parameter you know a temp a, a thermometer that will give you a sentiment on how people feel when it comes to stocks, you know, and right now this means people are really, really, really fearful and they are fearful about what is happening in Russia and Ukraine they, 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 because this has major implications. We're going to talk about that in deep details into a separate video, but it has to play with it because whether you want to accept it or no, AMC is a stock, all right? AMC is a stock among a market, so it will have to sometimes be driven up or driven down by the mechanics of the market. It's kind of like, you know, you own a Ferrari or a Porsche. It's not because that Porsche or that car can go all the way up to 250 or even 300 miles per hour that it necessarily means that you are going to always be running at that pace. Why? Because if you are driving on a road or even on a freeway where the limitation, the speed limitation is around 60 or 25 miles per hour, if it's a schooling zone, you have to drive at that pace, even though your car can go 10 times faster than that. That's the same thing. Or if you're stuck in a traffic jam or because there is an accident or, you know, constructions on the road, you will have to stop. All right. It doesn't matter if your car goes to 500 miles per hour, you have to stop. So it's kind of the same thing here with AMC. Now, let's look at, you know, things that you can actually look at and I will give you a, 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 a better lift your hopes up. Let's just use that, you know, as a word. Well, first off, this is not something specific to AMC. This drop, you know, when you look at the VIX index, this drop is not specific to AMC. Look. The Russell 2000, which AMC is heavily weighted into, this is kind of the first top stocks held into this Russell 2000. So whenever this will drop more than 1%, you can expect AMC to also drop big. That's just how things work, folks. I'm not, it's, 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 it's that's just how things, it is what it is. All right. Now, AMC on the contrary, when you look at what is happening on the regulation side of things, all right, this is the month of March. So we know that March is going to be a big month for AMC, starting with earnings. Even though this has dropped 4% despite earnings, you know, as you can read here, uh, strongest earnings in two years, well, it's because of, you know, this is a highly shorter stocks, meaning People here that short selling will do whatever they they, 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 they they have in their power to make sure it doesn't jump, even on good news. But the thing is, on the other side, you also have people that are willing to buy stocks or to buy specific stock showing strong improvement, showing you know strong signs of improvement in the way the business is being managed. And that is the case of AMC, you know. So AMC revenues increased by 621% from 21 to 2021 to 2022. And according to Mr. Adam Aaron, the CEO, this is supposed to double next year. So if I am looking for a place to park my money in such an environment where there is a high level of uncertainty, I'm looking for stocks that are really, really cheap. AMC, check that box. All right. So that's why a bunch of these suits, institutional owners, have been buying AMC lately, even though it's been going back down. And this is one of the major things here we have to keep in mind. AMC is a ticking bump, literally. Like, tomorrow you can wake up and this will be trading 10 times the price you're seeing today. Now, why? Because we all know that 
all of a sudden based on what the short sellers will do which might come from you know what the market is doing or what might come from something here or there the thing is it's going to be what we call a black swan event meaning it's going to come from at, at the very least moment you expect it to happen but when it starts running like it did run in in june of last year man you will you will not expect it but boom here we go it starts because it is a ticking bomb there is there is no way in the world this doesn't squeeze why because the short sellers are they are done it doesn't matter if it's from a market perspective it doesn't matter if it's from a regulations perspective it doesn't matter if it's from a money perspective they are cornered and it's just a matter of time now that time can be one week two weeks two months two years nobody knows but the thing is it should happen it has to happen so you just have to be a little bit patient but truth of the matter is anytime this can pop so don't beat yourself up and maybe use this as an opportunity to maybe add to your share count if you have dry powder if you have some cash sitting on the sidelines because in this current environment man i'm going to talk about it in a separate video man the only thing you can do to make sure your money works for you while you sleep is to buy stocks and amc is a great candidate of that so yeah